Hey guys, welcome to the new movie. Today we're doing Indiana Jones and the Crusade and the Last Crusade. This is the one with his dad. I saw this and they're playing at the Alamo. They're playing it. They were playing it Saturday and Sunday at 11 o'clock in the morning. I saw it Sunday because Saturday had another movie. Uh, we'll be we'll be reviewing this Robot Jack, Robot Jack, and we're gonna make that just soon because that's really good. But we're doing Indiana Jones Crusade for this one. Uh, this one is gonna be super simple because you've probably all seen Indiana Jones. So I'm gonna make it quick and so on. Uh, for movies that I feel like, like a movie like this, or if I do any of the original Star Wars movies, I'm going to do it pretty quick, because you all have probably seen these movies, you don't need me to tell you how amazing these movies are, so I'm, there's other ones I'm like, more curious, I try to go into more detail, or something maybe not everybody's seen, but this is one of the movies like, you probably seen it, so I'm not going to go into too, especially if you're watching this channel, and these detailed videos, you've probably seen it, but, I love this movie. I w okay, maybe not love because that, that's what you want to get but amazing this is an the Indian movies are amazing and this one uh this one or, or the last arc of my favorite it might be this one is this one and the last arc of my favorite i forget what one's my actual favorite like uh i've seen both of them in theaters i've actually seen all three of the original movies in theaters now it's actually really not cool um so yeah uh i like this movie so again to the quickly what the plot is uh and it has to do with the Holy Grail. It starts off with him as a kid. He finds like this stuff, uh, this um, thing like cross thing, and then he eventually loses it because the bad guys do get it or something. Get to get. It. But then it gets to the future where he's like, you know, walking at the uh, university that he walks at, and then he, he finds out his father's missing, and he has to go and save him, and da 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 da. Go on the whole thing to find the lost grail and everything, and it is great fun. And also, his dad is played by Sean Connor, who is great. Really amazing, and that's a, I'm like, yeah, that's a good choice. I like that. I really like that. It's his John Shona as his dad. That's really great. And then Indiana Jones is there support. So yeah, this movie is great, and they go on an adventure. Obviously, they have to fight Nazis and stuff. Because, of course, Nazis. It's like Captain America fighting Nazis, punching Hitler in the face. Indiana Jones fighting Nazis. Basically, it was like toe-to-toe -to -toe with Hitler. By toe-to-toe, -to -toe, I mean he, they were like in breathing distance. Like, they breathed on each he was right there for one scene, it was kind of a jokey scene. But, yeah, he could have punched Hitler in the face, and I wouldn't have been, that would have been cool to see Indiana Jones punch Hitler in the face. But, obviously it didn't happen, but, yeah. But, because it seems like everybody gets a crack at Hitler at some point. It's weird around that time, any superheroes or things like this. Yeah. But, uh, the movie's great, a lot of action, it's great. It's Steven Spielberg awesomeness, Indiana Jones awesomeness. Uh, so yeah, that basically, that's basically what I want to say without going into spoilers. Even though this is one of the ways I don't have to worry about spoilers because you've probably already seen it. But, like, I, I always try to keep spoilers out of the way. If I accidentally say something that's a spoiler, I call them. I'll be like, eh, spoiler. Um, usually if I say it's by accident, so sorry if I do. But, put it into the rating, this obviously gets a 9. Um, uh, 9 for me. The engine movies are great. I don't know if they, I consider, they're, they're 9, they're not 10s for me. Like, I really enjoy them, they're really great movies, but there's a lot of movies I consider tens, and for different reasons that definitely are completely different. Some of them are completely different than Indiana Jones. It is just great, I cannot. Indiana Jones movies do not get lower than a nine. Uh, maybe an eight for Temple of Doom, because Temple of Doom is. And, uh, except for Crystal Skull and Temple of Doom, might get an eight, but still, they're, they're, gonna get, like, they're not gonna get like low scores. Even Crystal Skull, I like that movie pretty much. Pretty good. But this one, I'm not talking about get nine, nines. Uh, really great, I'm excited to see. I really enjoyed this. I might actually review Lost Ark because I just didn't want to have really reviewed. I think at this point, so maybe I'll review that. Um, just even now, I haven't really seen it recently. I might just do it to get it. Cause we've done all all the other ones. Crystal Skull will not do because I've not seen that in a long time. That does not count. But that's a movie like I'm probably not gonna see in the theaters again. It has the option to. Uh, yeah, so I might do that one. But I don't know. What did you guys think of Lost Crusade in the comments below? I know what you guys are probably gonna say, so I don't even need. To, I don't know. But let's. Just talk about the movie. Let me know in the comments up last and let's talk about the movie. So thank you guys for watching. We got uh, uh sorry for these uh, I'm messing up here. I'm slowing my words all together. Thank you guys for watching the video. You guys can always stay up and see the next movie. Bye!